Shit. Aye. Aye. Nice chain, red ball man. Chain swing, light pretty thing. If my microphone isn't on, somebody's getting beat up. What's up guys? So welcome back to my channel. So for this week's video, we're gonna be doing something different. Something that's been very requested for no reason, but I mean, I guess. Basically, I have a family of six, so I'm obviously the sixth member. The other five of my family members are gonna be picking out my outfits to school for a week. They all have different tastes, so I think this is gonna be really funny. And plus, you guys always want me to incorporate more of my mom and my sisters and stuff, and my dad, so. Oh my god, I thought I wasn't recording. I didn't see the bread button. Um, um, I'm wearing Bum Life apparel. Go check them out on Instagram. Um, let's just see how this goes. Rachel, chop chop. This is gonna be our first contestant. Say a little bit about yourself. You're a little small, hold on. <laughs> kind of embarrassing. Okay, now I'm getting cut off. It's kind of rude. I'm eight years old and I'm in third grade. Period. Okay, say a little bit about your style. It's a microphone, honey. Don't be scared. I always like to wear pants. Same. And not, like, pink or purple. Basically, she's a tomboy. She's into, like, more, like, not feminine things. Am I right? Right. So she don't like pink and purple. She's, like, the total opposite of, like, Victoria, who's my other sister, who you'll see. She's going to be picking out my fit. So you can pick out anything out of my whole closet in all of these drawers. You don't want to look at the other stuff? Or you want these? These. Okay. If you wants me to wear these, like, stride pants, I got these from Zoffel. If you want me to wear a beanie and a belt and stuff, you can pick those, too. Okay. That's kind of good, though. Home that is tiny. Homegirl can't even reach. You can wear this shirt. My Billie Eilish shirt? Yeah. Okay, honey, bet. Can I pick a jacket? Yeah. Okay. Ooh, red? Yeah. Rachel, you're in my skincare drawers. Ugh, you better not. Honey, you're making this more difficult than it has to be. And this red jacket? That one? Yeah. Okay. What is that? You want those ones? Yeah. Okay. Where's the other one? Um, you gotta find it. It's right there. Bye, Bye hunting. Bye. So she's really gonna do me like that. Oh my god. Okay. What's up, Bad Biscuits? So, appreciate my nails with me. It's Monday today, and this is the first outfit my sister picked. Yes, I have a water stain. And my sister was gonna pick blue because that's her favorite color, and she's a little tomboy. I've been wearing this Billie Eilish shirt in so long. I think I got it in December or January. While I was washing my face, I just came up with a really good video idea. I want to do something along the lines of like 10 things that you should know before being a YouTuber. I don't know if I'm going to title it that, but I want to do something along those lines. I think that would be really helpful because I know a lot of my viewers like want to start a channel, have already started a channel, like are having trouble like growing and stuff. I could just talk about like my experience of like my four and a half years being on YouTube. Honestly, I feel like like going through the YouTube journey journey i feel like being a youtuber or whatever you kind of have to learn from like experiences you kind of have to see like what works with your channel what doesn't work I, don't know, I feel like it's different for every youtube channel so i don't really know what to exactly talk about like one thing i put like as an example is that people are always like putting you on this like pedestal that you don't belong on I feel like a lot of people kind of make me being a youtuber more dramatic than it actually is i'm literally a freshman in high school like i'm a regular teenager except i talk to a camera and I have grown an audience. I hate when people try to make me feel like that. Like it makes me, it like, like makes me feel like I'm like flaunting it, which really they're the ones who's flaunting it, but it's not them. I don't know how to explain it, but it's just like people try to make it a bigger deal than it actually is, and it's so annoying. And you have like random people coming up to you asking for a shout out, and you're in that awkward situation, like, um, but I'll tell you how many people, random ass people, walked up to me and asked for a shout out. Never say no to people just because it puts me in an awkward situation. 
I put Vaseline on my eyelashes yesterday because I've been wearing makeup like all I think I wore it for like three days straight mascara specifically so I kind of want to give them a little break you know no, I've been really loving wearing makeup like I like wearing makeup in general recently I've been really really appreciating it I really want to start doing better this month. One thing I really want to start doing better this month is that I really want to start working out more because I literally pay $15 for a membership and I never go. Because, like, I don't want to go, it's because I don't have time. Like, I need to start making time for the gym because... The thing that I realize a lot of people don't understand... The thing that I realized a lot of people really don't understand is that they think that I just grew all my subscribers overnight. Which literally makes me laugh because it took me four and a half years to get where I am. And I didn't even start growing until maybe a year ago. But think of those three years. You have to be really dedicated to go at it for three years and not get any progress, like not be any type of successful. I had no progress the first three years. I would keep doing it. I kept making videos because I had a passion for it. I really liked making videos. I feel like a lot of people nowadays, I mean, I don't want to assume. I feel like a lot of people nowadays just expect, especially like people that I go to school with and like my locals and stuff. If they're starting YouTube, like just and expect subscribers because they saw me do it and they're like oh well if she can do it I can do it too but you know what I respect it you could do what you want to do if you really have a passion for YouTube and you really like expressing your creativity on YouTube and you like doing videos yes I encourage you to do it if you're doing it just because you saw me do it and you saw how easy it is it's easy now for me because I know how to film I know how to edit I know what you guys like I know what you don't like those last three years were not easy and you guys don't know how many times I wanted to quit YouTube even though I didn't even see it as a job it was literally like a side hobby I still posted on it I was always editing always filming because I wanted this to be something like an option for me you know I didn't know about the money part until I think maybe a year or two ago all I knew was that you could get money from YouTube I didn't know about all the sponsorships that you could get I don't know it's just a whole nother world out there that I didn't even know about I don't know I don't want to come up oh, I don't know oh my god <laughs> okay I'm gonna I was about to say curl my bangs I'm gonna straighten my bangs and we're about to leave like right now so okay, so we're gonna show this horrid outfit real quick all right no shade to you Rachel but your fashion sense sucks Ugh, I look like a cowboy. Okay, we're just gonna hide that. This red jacket from Tilly's. I'm probably gonna overheat today because I haven't worn a jacket in so long. I'm wearing these pants from Zafo, and then I'm wearing my blue and red Vans. I'm wearing this white belt from Princess Polly. It's super cute, just not with this outfit. It's pretty normal, so people are probably gonna think that I picked this out. But, you know, we'll see. We got the bad bitch in here. Uh, she's kind of cracked now. Okay, who do you think picked out my outfit today? No, no, no. no. Failed my geometry test, insert test score here. I literally called the protractor a scale. And I still need to take my quadratics test. And I need to retake my geometry test. I'm kind of failing school. Why are you posing for my camera? Now we're doing some stations for no reason. Plankies. We're gonna do some plankies. Basically, he's calling us fat, so. Ow, my legs hurt. Ugh. The fan is resting. Anyways. The workout queen. Oh, good. Oh, we got a switch? Yes, yes. What the fuck she doing? What the fuck she doing? She turned that work. Hold up. Boss, it could. Look at that. Look at that. <laughs> he drew fake earrings. You need a fucking... <laughs> leave it on there, leave it on there. <laughs> Call me. Call me. <laughs> Why are you measuring my ankles? Uh, like small. <laughs> go to Marcus. <laughs> oh. Now we're on our way to 
going to Walmart because we're going to get a few things. Um, we're in my mom's car right now because earlier when my sister's picking us up from school, the car just wanted to stop out of nowhere. Bruh! Give me a shot. We're just like, was stopping and it was so scary and I thought my life was over. But it is so hot today for no reason. It feels like it's like 100 degrees, but it's only 51. I'll see y'all at Walmart. Okay, so right now we're in the pill section. Got these cranberry pills, but they're in like gummies, and we don't want gummies. We want the regular pills. But then I heard like it's really good. Um, I feel like I heard that like apple cider vinegar is really good for your like daily health and whatnot. I don't know. That's just what I heard. Makes me some cute little scrunchies. They're like. I don't know. Then I got these two chocolates for strawberries. Strawberries are down there, you know, looking all cute. And we made chocolate covered strawberries for Valentine's Day, which was like two months ago. I became obsessed with them. So like I've just started like eating them a lot. So I want to make some tonight. Okay, so we're in... Oh my god, I thought they were going to open another window. Okay, Starbucks drive through And I'm going to give you guys a little haul because I don't really want to do it at home. got this green five star folder because all my folders are like effed up now some chips. my forehead looks so dark we got loofahs because mine is kind of big though i got this stuff for my transformation video it's like this jergens daily glow self tanner thing but it's not really like a self tanner like it's kind of more natural i guess got some new little like brow pencils so i can start making faux freckles because my other thing is like starting to run out and it's like low-key trash so i wanted to get some new ones scrunchies and then i want to ew I wanted to start like trying out supplementary pills so I got apple cider vinegar to like lose weight that's what my sister said these are for but I know they're like healthy for you and then I have cranberry ones for you know yeah. ah! cranberry pill bro why does this have so much ice in it <laughs> to conclude this day I really hated my outfit I only worn these pants one other time because they're literally like always rising up my ankles I like they want to be high water so bad. Long ass legs, so they don't really work with me. But hella hot today for no reason, and my sister really had me. See you guys tomorrow for day dos. Oh my god, my forehead looks so big. Hot biscuits. So I just got back from the gym because this is biscuit number two. Introduce yourself. Hola biscuits. My name. <laughs> oh, so she's being bold now. Mm. My name is oh. Victoria. I'm her sister. Mm -hmm. She's my second. We're both the middle children. That explains it. She's gonna be the person picking out my Tuesday's outfit. <coughs> it's like the opposite of Rachel. She's like more girly. Also, they have their own channel. Subscribe at your own risk. Selena Sis Stars with the AR. Yeah, and I like more colors. Yeah, she's like more into colors. She's like a mini me, basically. So you could pick out anything. Yeah, but you better not have me looking like a fool how Rachel did. She's really getting into it. Uh, what about these pants right here? The yellow ones. Okay. Okay, you do not have to treat me clothes like that. Lupe. Lupe. <laughs> oh, that's cute. Then I want to pick... You have a yellow merch. Mm -hmm. I mean... Girl! These ones. Honey, I cannot wear those. I could just cut in. Yeah, I'm just getting bit. No, those are some knockoff sketchers. Ah. These ones? No, they're... this purple. Okay. She's gonna pick my purple Converse. Oh, those look good on here, but in real life, they're like actually way darker. Okay, some scrunchies up there. These two together, but girl, I'm not wearing two headbands. What did you That's think this was? Said. Okay. You want that? Yeah. What? Want that? Yeah. Are you sure? Yeah. Pick my makeup. Where is your makeup? Pink and yellow eyeshadow. Girl. And then like purple all right here and then you put it, can, whatever it's called right here and then pink and I'm not doing no cut crease at 7 in the morning uh, pink. Yeah. Actually pink Okay pink? Yeah Okay Thank you for your time honey Now go along Queen has left See y'all tomorrow Hello everybody I put my hair in those little wavy things It came out so I don't really 
What is this? My hair's still wet. My, my hair ain't even wavy, buggy. I'm doing something really exciting on Saturday. I'm so excited. I'm not going to tell you guys what it is yet. You guys are just going to have to see. I'm going to get a piercing today or tomorrow for my transformation video because I've been wanting a second piercing anyways. They wanted my nose pierced, but my mom is... She won't let me get it, so... Now I have to resort to a second option. Y'all want to see my berries, though? I made some chocolate covered strawberries. Yes. Muy bueno. I just watched Joanna Setti's video right now. It's the one where she was basically just talking about school and like the benefits of it and whatever. And honestly, it kind of opened my eyes. Honestly, I get her point and I actually really agree with her on that video. I agree with her how she was talking about like most YouTubers like drop out of school. Or not even YouTubers, just like regular teens. They drop out of school like thinking that YouTube is going to support them forever and I completely disagree with that. I definitely think like me as a YouTuber, I don't think I'm going to last forever. I don't think this is going to support me forever. For some people it does, but that's like 2% of YouTubers. Kind of just like a phase to me, like I feel like it's just like an era. I feel like we're like what's liked now, like trendy now. I feel like this time period is gonna like change and there's gonna be new and better YouTubers coming. I feel like this is just kind of like an in the moment type thing, you know? This week I feel so weird. It's like my last week and then spring break, which is so relieving. This is the last Tuesday. It's the last Tuesday until next Tuesday, but like next Tuesday I don't have school, so like, yay. Honestly, I was considering like being online schooled or like homeschooled like everybody else But my parents like really don't like the fact that I'm not gonna be like having social interactions that they think I won't I do want to like do all the experiences that you have in high school that you can't have in online school like prom I think that's all but I don't think you guys understand like how hard I really try on my videos like I edit probably three to four times a week I'm always editing like everybody in my family knows not to mess with me when I'm editing I'm always filming I'm always trying to come up with like creative content I'm just always doing something related to YouTube top of that I like try to go to the gym I go to school which consumes like a lot of my time Ever since I think I've gotten big on YouTube or just like I started growing more lost interactions with a lot of people honestly I don't know if it's my fault or theirs but like I I've had a lot of falling outs since I started getting bigger. I got these really cute pairs of socks. Like this is like a banana and then this is a cherry. I have a whole essay due today and I only typed the intro and the first paragraph and I have like three other paragraphs to type. So I'm kind of stressed but I don't know why I'm so chill right now. Okay, actually when I'm editing, I want to do something. So I want to see how many subscribers I have by the end of the week. So today's Tuesday. I should have done this on Monday. Right now I have 542,658 subscribers. I hate that YouTube copyright is so strict now. It gets me so mad. I made a video about how I was reacting to my music leads and I posted it, I think like two or three two days ago so mad because it got copyrighted and it literally had like i think six seconds of copyright music so I did this in hawaii and it was actually really cute so i'm not complaining i'm so sick if you can like hear me sniffling it's because i'm sick We're actually having spirit week at our school this week because i don't even know why actually i'll see you guys at school because i feel like i'm being really boring bye this looks so bad you see so I finished the little eye look. My sister said she wanted me to wear eyeshadow. And honestly, I miss it because I haven't worn eyeshadow, like, even, not even in school. I take my two supplement pills right now. Pulsar vinegar and the cranberry pills. So, I'm gonna take these. So let me know in the comments if you've tried these and if they actually work. I've only done them for, like, a day. So, I don't really know. So, this is what my outfit looks like. Victoria was the one that picked it out. And it's not that bad, actually. I'm wearing my pink eyeshadow and then I'm wearing my locket from Honey Lock Co. I have a discount code, so I'll put it down below if you guys want to get a locket. I got this on Depop, like in the beginning of the school year, and then my pants are from Doll Scale. These are just some purple one-star Converse. I don't know where my friend got them. She got them for me for Christmas. I have these little scrunchy ponytail things. I got these from Walmart, I think. Just like this pack of little scrunchies, and I bought them, so I'm wearing. So I'll probably just see you guys at school. <laughs> This is what my eyeshadow looks like. Right now we're in the cafeteria because the school wants to be ghetto and couldn't go in the gym and it's just about like 10 degrees outside so they really, this was the only choice. I just finished typing my essay and I was really stressed about that. I'd never eaten in the cafeteria at lunch like my whole 
Eight months left. Right. It doesn't work. So why are you touching my ponytail? Baddies, we're in our last period. Yes! So I just got some new pencils. But we're gonna go thrifting after school. Huh? Hi guys, so sorry to disappoint, but that is all the footage I got from this day. I don't know why I didn't vlog. Like, I literally got two clips and they were both like a minute each. Sorry in advance. Um, also, if this video is kind of boring, it's because I was literally sick the whole week and I just, my mood was just low. So if you can like sense that, then I'm sorry. My apologies. Hopefully, you don't click off. Okay. Ah! Girl, do not give me those. I can't fit in them. Tell me what you can't wear and what you can't. I just said that. Why well, do I want to put it back there? Why can't you wear them? Because I can't fit in them. Did you not just hear me? Can't. I don't know what those are. These. The only other light pair of jeans you have in here. These are the ones that you just got? No. Can you wear the ones you just got? Are you recording? Oh, boy! These are kind of cute. What size are they? Really? You're not wearing them. Oh my freaking god, I don't want to be putting all your stuff up. Well, well then don't grab it. it. Oh, you should have told me you couldn't wear that. I don't think I want you to wear these. I can't believe it. Well, my tank tops are in there. Where? It's going to be cold tomorrow. Is it really? Yes. All right, I got you, I got you. Wait, wait, wait on your pictures. I didn't really, like, introduce her, but y'all already know who she is, so... I'm not wearing this. Why? These are so cute. Because I don't want to be talking to Renato. Bye. How do you want my makeup? The brownish, if you wear this, do a brownish light color. And this, dark purple. On my eyelids? Do you want me looking like a hooker? Dramatic. Okay, so that was literally 11 minutes of footage. You did not. This one. Oh. oh my god, you get on my nerves. Okay, bye guys. Okay, let's take some pills. She's fat. Cranberry pill. Apple cider vinegar pill. We took our drugs. Now it's 10.44, um, I didn't go to school because the girl was just a little bit tired. And I had a really bad headache, so you know, I went back to sleep. I was just gonna be absent today, but I have to perform in theater my monologue. I'm so scared. I hate performing by myself. Like, even when I perform in groups, I'm so, like, ugh, tense. And everybody's always saying, like, oh, you're a YouTuber. Like, why is it that big of a deal? Cut off your sentence right there. I'm a YouTuber that talks to herself. Talks to a camera in her own room. Yes, I talk to an audience, but like it's not like I'm actually talking to an audience. I'm so scared, and then I also have to turn in a damn essay. I really want to get my nails redone. Like I like these, but I get them like a pastel, multicolored. This company sent me clothes, and I have to do like a promo post for them on my Instagram today. I tried on the shirt, and it is so cropped on me. It's actually really cute, even though it's like hella cropped. It's super cute. The pink one, it looks like this, this material, and then it has these really long sleeves. Do it look like my arm is this long? No. This is actually really cute. It's just super like low v-neck, so... My mom made me some food. The thing I hate so much about when like brands or companies or just sponsorships in general, I hate when they like send me something and they don't even wait until like it gets here to like start making times for when I'm gonna post and like when I'm gonna mention like a due date basically and it's really annoying. I'm not saying that as if like I'm on a high horse and like you guys could just send me stuff for free and I'll post whenever I want to. The stuff will barely get to my house and they'll already be trying to say like post tomorrow blah blah blah. Like, I don't know. I feel like they just don't really take into account that I'm busy and I have other things to do. I was looking at you and you was looking at me and I was thinking whoa, whoa, whoa. <laughs> go to Marcus go to Marcus I need to try this stuff Friggin's like self tanner thing but it's supposed to be like really natural oh my god I forgot to tell you guys this my favorite mascara by the way it's the Lash Paradise this is the one that I've been using for a really long time now so I'm meeting my manager this week um today's Wednesday so I'm meeting her in two days I'm so scared because I've never had a manager like I've seen like a lot of other youtubers they have managers and stuff it's scary because I've never had a manager I don't know like how any of this works I'm to Santa Barbara for spring break for like two days yesterday my mom was like pick a hotel 
because we need to already book it because my mom she is barely gonna book the hotel until yesterday even though we're gonna be going in like less than a week so i was like girl and then she was like okay find a hotel and we'll book it tonight so then i was like okay bet book hotel and it was like pretty cheap it was like 200 and something a night so that was like pretty good to me my mom was like okay are you sure it's in santa barbara and i was like yes like why wouldn't it be she was like are you sure and i was like yes turns out it wasn't in santa barbara it was in San Santa Ynez Valley. I don't know, but I'm kind of embarrassed. This is so humiliating. Which basically, that's like 45 minutes away from Santa Barbara, so it's like even farther. So I booked the wrong hotel, and it was actually non-refundable, so my mom couldn't get her money back, so we like have to stay there now. And then after I filmed this clip, I actually found out I booked the hotel in the wrong dates. And I booked it in VidCon dates and not spring break dates so i booked a hotel in july and not april so i just don't know what to say um so basically never let me pick your hotel room because i don't know how i did that like i literally don't know what was going through my head i saw it at the top it was like saint santa yanez valley and i was like hmm I wonder what that is. Turns out it was a whole different city. I thought it was just like a, I thought that that's what the like place was called. My sister picked out two outfits as you saw yesterday. So the first outfit I can't wear, like I'll literally show you. I already tried it on and this is the same top, but it's just a different color because they sent me two. This is what it looks like. It's just too cropped and it's honestly really uncomfortable. It looks super weird right here. It has like this weird flap and it just makes it look so so I'm not wearing this. So this is the outfit that Alexis picked. Shirt says I'm baby in like glitter lettering and it's from Hex Girl on Instagram. My Adidas purple jacket. I'm wearing these jeans from Laura's Boutique and then I have my corduroy purple Vans from Urban Outfitters. This cute little locket from Honey Lock Co. So that's the outfit and I'll see you guys at school because I don't know what else I'm doing. Hey guys, we're at lunch. <laughs> <laughs> oh. Yeah. Going to have water so they gave us this nasty low calorie Okay. Okay. Now I'm gonna put four on the floor to get four minutes till lunch is over. Yeah. Yeah. Say hi. Do you even have a board? Okay. Well, if, I, if I probably started skating again. Oh, yeah. Also, the only footage I got from Wednesday, I only vlogged once. Okay, hey, hold on, girl. Like, is this cute? Okay. My hair is like this long. This is my mom. Um, yeah, she's the mother of the family. Say something about yourself. This kid just wrecked another car. Girl, not me. That's it. She popped a tire. Anyway, yeah. you can pick out anything you want. Okay, I want you to wear oh. Hollister jeans, skinny ones. For these skinny okay. jeans. Why are you with holding holes? them like that? Those are from OOTD Fesh. Where are your shirts at? <laughs> Literally right in front of them. She's talking about the cute ones. Do you have red shoes? Yeah. You wear this. Okay. With that, you said I get to pick. You didn't say there's restrictions and stipulations. Well, there is. I'm gonna wear my Hollister shirt and those jeans. My sandals. No, do the Cortez. Do the something on our desk. That's cute. Okay. Can y'all get out of my room for real? Get out of my room. Okay. Tea. Show up. Dude, I miss playing music in my videos, but now copyright is so strict, it's so annoying. Okay, so I'm gonna put on my locket right now. Locket's from Honey Lock Co. If you're wondering, it's on Instagram. I'm so excited. We only have two, wait, two more days. <laughs> I have like two tests I need to take in my math class, and then I have like two biology tests I need to take. Yay! Am I right? The eyelash color kind of sucks. Yesterday I took literally the cutest pictures ever. Go follow me on my Instagram. Um, they were really cute, so it's no big deal. I just realized my fly is like all the way down. Let's take the drugs. We're gonna do the apple cider vinegar first. It smells so nasty. My nose has been so stuffy and it's so hard to sleep. 
I hate when I'm editing and I have like 10 minutes of footage and then when I like edit it and cut it all down I only use like a minute of it because literally all I do is to like get ready and then I talk like one time and then that's all the footage I have you know, I used to be really talkative in my videos like I would be super just like Energetic in the morning like for no reason. I think I just wasn't feeling it this week Okay, but let me show you the fit because my sandals on yet But I'm gonna show you guys the outfit that my mom picked out which bless her because I thought she was gonna pick like a mom outfit But you know she went for the casual look I'm wearing this burgundy button-up top from Hollister pants are from OOTD fash Love this really big rip right here. It's super cute and then she wants me to wear white sandals So that's what I shall do probably see you guys at school I don't really vlog that much at school just because it's just really hard taking out my camera I don't know why I'm just such I'm a parasosa parasosa yeah, I'm kind of the lazy gal, so sometimes I just don't want to do it, but I try to vlog more because I don't want this video to be super, super short, so. Um, my parents picked up my outfit. Brenda, stop shaking the desk, cuz. Sorry. This is, I made it all by myself. Yeah, sure. Why are y'all mad, dude? Like, Brenda's still kind of a maker. Keep up. <laughs> Shut up. We're rally today. Yeah. There, there, what else do I do? Oh my god. <laughs> We're trying to make that. Oh my god! Yeah. It is not my feet. Don't ever. Get your feet out of my feet. I did not want to smell their stinky feet. Maybe. I already know they stink. Yeah, maybe it's the culprit. This was actually my favorite performance, so I don't want anybody trying to come for me saying I shaded them. No. It's just the edit. Calm. Damn. Damn. <laughs> The hard lenses too, because like my eyesight is just the hard lenses. They'll like help my eyes from. So right now we're in biology. We have a sub right now, and it's my friend's mom. Kind of awkward. And so I saw her, and I was like, Oh my fucking god! And we made eye contact, and I was like, ah, Awkward, but it's fine. I'm scared she's gonna get me in trouble, so we should end the vlog here, though. It's pizza day, though. Comfortable wearing this. Uh, she wears an undershirt with that. Yeah, tank top. Uh, true, true. Rocker emo girl. Oh. Mm -hmm. Ooh. Don't you wear something else underneath? No. No. You can give me pants. You rocking the belly it? out? I like it, the Freddy Cougar. Old uh, school Freddy Mac. <laughs> Like that? Nightmare on Elm Street actually is what I meant to say. Nightmare on Elm Street. Where be Waldo? Where be Desi? Right there. Uh, 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 uh. Unicorn lollipop. <laughs> oh my god, you <laughs> Purple coveralls. Uh -huh. I like these purple coveralls. Let's keep this in Coveralls? Do you mean overalls? Overalls, coveralls. They don't look like they cover Who this. says coveralls? I yeah. Well, I'm feeling purple. I know it's like Barney. The hey, look at she has like, look at right there. I 
Come on, what? Oh my god, you're really gonna have me looking like that. Purple oh. pair of coveralls. At least give me something decent. Ew! You can match it with the tummy, tummy that ain't pain. Ugh. Oh my god, you're really gonna have me looking like that. I could like this, like one sleeve up, one sleeve down. Uh, I'm, not about I'm definitely not doing that. Boy. I've never seen a pair of purple shirt would you wear it with. A regular long sleeve, like a, I have a light purple long sleeve. Not this one? Uh, boy, what no. What about the purple old school colors, yeah? Those are the colors of my school, purple and gold. Oh my god, I have to wear it. <gasps> I like this. No. I'm not wearing that. I'm gonna get bullied. Stopped it recording because he just likes to talk a lot, you know? Very chatty like me. He showed us where those purple overalls so I can look like Barney. Disney can wait. Is Barney is not Disney. Let's forget I said that. He picked some Lakers colors because he wants me to get bullied. I know. And he wants me to do a purple headband and yellow eyeshadow. I don't know what. Also, tomorrow's the last day until spring break. <laughs> I'm so excited. <laughs> I dropped my tea. <laughs> Bro. <laughs> okay, bye. Hi guys, so um, currently 9.55, I didn't go to school, I know, big surprise. I was just super sick this morning, like I felt disgusting. My mom was gonna pick me up early anyways because we need to go to Santa Clarita to meet with my manager just to, you know, determine if she's my manager, basically. It's like a super new thing to me, we've never even looked into managers. So, as you saw, my dad picked out this outfit. Like, for what? I don't know if I want to wear it, like, while meeting my manager, I feel like that's gonna be so... I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. I'm gonna wear the purple overalls. Sorry, I'm just not gonna wear this shirt with them. Like, I'm sorry, but it's not happening. I would have worn it to school if I went to school, but not in front of my manager, so. I don't know, but I have like 30 minutes to get ready, so bye. Um, okay, so I look like Barney. Really not a big deal. I'm watching a bunch of videos about everybody going to Coachella, and I feel kind of left out you know kind of jelly but probably just go next year my mom were actually gonna go this year because she found some tickets for us for weekend two didn't end up getting them because they were like 500 dollars each which i know that's like the regular you know like the standard price but that's kind of expensive just for some music festival like come on now coachella's like famous so so nervous to meet up with my manager because i've never like done anything like this you know a lot of youtubers like even youtubers that are smaller than me already have managers like imagine if i wore this with that yellow shirt i would be looking a mess I'm getting like cystic pimples like up here like by my hairline um i don't know why but i'm gonna need them to stop we're gonna take our pills i'm gonna start with raspberry i hate taking the apple cider vinegar one because you could literally smell it and it's disgusting not gonna do a lot of makeup but i wanted to do like a little bit of makeup <laughs> okay so i'm probably just gonna fast forward this part because it's kind of boring Okay, so I'm done getting ready, and I'm going to give you guys an outfit of the day. Actually, I'm not going to give you it yet. I'm going to do my hair, and then I'll give you guys a little outfit of the day. Okay, so, okay, so I just finished getting ready. I actually really, I messed with the outfit. I don't know, I feel kind of purpled out. Like, I feel kind of cute, though. This is what I look like, and then my outfit just looks like this. Um, My headband is from Amazon. My overalls are from unzi.com. Um, my long sleeve, I think I just ordered on Target, like just a purple basic long sleeve. Cute little rainbow socks from Unzi, and then these shoes are from Delia's, and they're just super cute. I've had these overalls for so long now, and my dad picked them out yesterday, and I literally forgot I had them. So, you know, so we're kind of running late, so I'll probably just update you in the car. Me and my mom wanted to film a video today, like a drive with us, talking about a certain subject. But I don't know if we're still doing that, but... Hi guys! Wait, is it in focus? I just met with my manager and I really like her. She Redo it again. 
Yeah. Smack my manager, she's so nice. And actually, like, I didn't know if I wanted a manager or not, but like, now that I met her, like, I feel like, you know, we just have a connection. She actually got me some stuff, like, she didn't have to. She said that she was watching my videos and that she saw me using like real technique stuff. Got me some stuff, and it's so sweet. Like, if you're watching this, thank you. I'll do a little haul. She got me, like, because she said, like, they worked with, um, Real Techniques, like they, this was one of the brands that they worked with, so she got me some stuff. It was so nice of her. She got me this little set of like um, eyeshadow brushes and little sponges. This is a concealer brush. Never actually heard of this. This is called the Prep Plus Prime Set, and I've never seen this like in stores. It has this little like metal roll thing, like that I think that you use under your eyes, and it has some prep. I don't know, it just has some brushes. Got a sponge, this mini expert. Oh, I think it's the foundation brush, another concealer brush. Which brush? I actually have the same one. And, um, I have like three of these brushes already. I don't know if you guys watch my videos, but I always use this to put on my lights. So, dimpling brush and then a powder brush. That was a really good experience. Right now we're, I don't know, we're at like this little shopping center. So we're gonna go to Chili's. I wanna look at some shoes, but... Okay, so I talked a lot more about my manager. But like my mom put on the air conditioner so you couldn't hear me, but it was a really good some of the water that I like to drink out of. <laughs> it was a really good experience and I love my manager and So we're right here. I'm not gonna bring my camera in because I just wanna like do a little bit of shopping and then I'll give you guys a haul. So I went to Tilly's and I wanted to do a haul here because I was gonna do a haul at my house, <laughs> but we're not gonna be there for like another hour, so I didn't Oh that when you get off video. Okay. Oh. okay, if you guys like watch my videos, you know I have like a bunch of different colors of like Dickies or whatever. Green has been like one of my favorite colors recently besides like purple. I really wanted green Dickies and I didn't know they actually had them. I thought like it was just one of the colors that they didn't have, but I saw them at Chili's and I was so excited. Came with this little Dickies belt. I've, ne I've like never seen this belt, so they're just some green. They're like all the other ones except they're just green, so they were like $40, which is kind of expensive. So I got these. I'm really excited because green is kind of the color right now. I realized I don't really have like any basic, like I have like a lot of like colorful and just like out of the box stuff, but I don't really have like basics. So I wanted to get this like a basic black, like kind of crop top thing. All I have is like t-shirts, so I wanted to get like a little crop top thing to wear with like high-waisted stuff. Ooh. This tan colored, it's like the same thing, except it's just like a tan color. This white tube top because I have a lot of tube tops, but I don't have one in white. So I got a shirt and then it's just spoiled me. And then I just got this set of like gold hoops because I only have one pair of hoops that I actually like, so I wanted to get new ones. Uh, that's everything I got from Tilly's, and I'll probably see you guys when I get home. So that's the last clip that I got on Friday. So thank you for watching. I know this was a long video for no reason, but um thank you for watching and i'll see you guys in my next video